for any uh, scar that appears on our skin, uh, the best time to treat it is if it's uh, as fresh as possible. Preferably, scars uh, should be less than two years old when they're treated. Although if one is younger or a very small child, it may, uh, may be possible even after that. So uh, <clears throat> the way we treat it using herbs is we found that some halicrysum species, um, a plant that's called in Hebrew maccabin, you can apply it topically on, e on any uh, scar tissue on your skin. Uh, pre um, preferably, it's this type of plant that is basically, basically inside it. We both distill using steam and essential oil with it, from it, which contains italidion. And it's been shown by the French doctors uh, Franchon and Penoel in the early 1990s in a hospital in Lyon in France that uh, these plants are very beneficial apparently because they uh, provide um, a, an ingredient called italidion which helps to uh, um, contact various, uh, um, various blood clots, even fine ones, and unclog fine blood vesicles. So it enables uh, blood to flow better into the uh, site where the scar is at and it can then provide more collagenase uh, enzyme which breaks down excessive uh, collagen which has uh, accumulated when, the, when a wound was being healed. So this, uh, this way apparently it stimulates um, um, scar healing. It's an extensive reference to Helichrysum italicum being effective for treating uh, scars in the arom aromatherapy literature. You, one can look up in, the, in Google and find lots of references and lots of uh, very enthusiastic uh, comments about how it's used. So therefore we cultivate the plant extensively. And in the conditions of the uh, Jindarian Desert, it's been found extremely effective for this uh, aim. And we have this oil uh, made Maccabeam oil made from this plant, which is not also beneficial for this condition, but all sorts of dermatitis, making hematomas disappear because it helps the blood get reabsorbed, uh, all sorts of uh, severe eczemas, as well as these ingredients are present in a different balm called Mazor, which was uh, uh, both, the, both these substances, Maccabeam and Mazor, were accepted by the Canadian Ministry of Health as topical treatments for eczema-related conditions.